What is the Monetary Authority of Singapore? Mars Singapore was founded in 1971 to address the problems of communication and coordination between government departments. Monetary Authority of Singapore was created to consolidate all monetary policies in the city-state. Is in charge of controlling and overseeing the nation's financial sector. Mars has been committed to promoting sustained economic growth with a focus on non-inflationary development. The goal of the Singapore Central Bank is to be an international financial center that is refined and reliable. In this article, we will be going to have an overview of the working and functioning of Mars Singapore. So, without any additional worry, let's jump into it. The functioning of Mars Singapore Many Legacy Financial institutions around the world have been accused of not adapting to modern consumer and business needs. Innovative fintech companies have made a significant influence on the event in the last few years. Mars and SG are one of the few organizations that continue to evolve in today's fast-paced world. The function of Mars Singapore is as follows. Supervision of financial services The Mars regulates Singapore's financial sector. It oversees all financial transactions and ensures transparency and disclosure. Controls the government's financial reserves Mars acts as the government's banker. The government can transact worldwide and make deposits through Mars. Government Securities Mars is ultimately responsible for any securities issued by the government. Serve as Singapore's central bank. It serves as Singapore's central bank, which includes managing the country's monetary regulations, printing money, monitoring the system of payments, and acting as the government's banker and economic representative. Policies and Responsibilities of Monetary Authority of Singapore, MAS, Mars Singapore plays a significant role in the daily lives of Singaporeans and local businesses. Their practices have an impact on almost all aspects of daily life, despite their subtleties. These are the areas where the responsibility and function of Mars Singapore are most active. Printing money The printing of money is perhaps the most important responsibility of Mars. All banknotes printed in Singapore are under the sole control of the Monetary Authority of Singapore. When publishing cash, Mars should assess inflation, interest percentages, and currency depreciation. Exchange rates The basket of currencies is used to adjust currency valuations. Mars aggregates business rates between the dollar Singapore and four primary trading partners. Instead of basing the exchange rate against one partner, it aggregates against several partners. This allows Mars to keep a relative strength of its money with other currencies. To prevent foreign manipulation, the currencies in the bundles are maintained confidential. Policy on interest rates Mars Singapore authorizes interest percentages to float, just like various nations. Singapore is more concerned with its exchange rates than anyone's control mechanism for interest rates. Because of Singapore's size, the interest price policy authorizes Singapore to fight with bigger trading partners while permitting it to stay at a global financial Junction. Fintech Mars Singapore has been given a new role by Fintech. This organization is responsible to set fintech policies in areas such as data sharing, privacy, security, and confidentiality. The Monetary Authority of Singapore has to now implement, enforce, and support organizations in upgrading the legacy system to meet the changing global requirements. Hence, why is this important for businesses? Due to Singapore's strong trade position and business-friendly environment, 
Startups and major fintech companies often set up shops in Singapore. In 2016, MAS created the fintech regulatory sandbox to facilitate this. Both established and startup financial institutions can use this space to test the waters before they enter the market.